Hello beautiful people on the internet! Today I want to show you how you can make your own kombucha and grow your own Scooby from scratch. Let's get into it! You will need a jar, half a cup of granulated sugar, store-bought kombucha, make sure you see some Scooby floating around that kombucha, some apple cider vinegar to rinse the jar in case there's any bacteria, cheesecloth to put on top of the jar, and three bags of black tea. Once it's room temperature, you can put it into your jug. So I've placed my kombucha jar up here in my room because my room always is fairly warm and it needs to have a warm environment. I will give you some updates on the process. This is the little mother, the bacteria that's growing. It looks like a little embryo. <laughs> but yeah, this is day five. I think so far it's looking pretty healthy. Ooh, let's see. Ooh, snap. So it seems like it's getting a little film on top. Whoa, 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 whoa. Check that. Oh no. I hope it's still okay. All right, so basically I didn't know if my kombucha was good, so I posted it on Instagram. Turns out that I didn't have to wait that long for it to grow, so it's ready to drink. baby open. Damn! This is really good. Oh wow, it's so sweet as well. Yeah, it's not as fizzy as usual. I'm pretty sure if I left it longer it'd be fizzy. Let's hit the kombucha there. One of the things that can help you understand yourself more is practicing critical thinking. It's going way out like the sky. 